Okay, let's connect ourselves to the Play Store and uh, see what we can get out of Google's version of the App Store. So we've got a testing account we can use. Point. I don't really fancy putting credit card details in in front of you. So I'm going to skip. Accept your terms and conditions. So the Play Store works in a very similar way to iTunes, which uh, more people are familiar with. If you don't know what either of those are, they're basically services offered, um, this one's offered by Google and it's a marketplace where you can buy apps which um, at least to a point have had a certain degree of testing on them to, uh, to, to make sure that they can uh, work on your device um, it uh, provides a secure payment marketplace uh, to be able to put your details in and, uh, and interact and buy software for your device um, so you can run apps on the device, you can purchase music uh, books and uh, and movies within the apps category there are a certain number that are free and a certain number that are paid for um, so let's just uh, pop into movies to begin with show off uh, sort of the streaming features of the device so let's pop into one of the movies so you can see that's available to rent for £3.49 Let's just pull up a trailer. So you see this is streaming in from YouTube at the moment. So it needs an opportunity to buffer, which is what this symbol is. So it's drawing down. Oh, here we go. family affair so let's not watch any more of that. You can see that actually the quality of the, uh, the, the film you'll be getting is very good. Full 1080p. Okay. Let's drop back another layer. Now let's go in and have a little bit of a look at the apps available. So, huge array of apps. But let's go and pick up uh, something that would be a real favourite in the UK location. Which would be BBC iPlayer. You accept and download. You can see the downloading information here. Also, bottom right-hand corner, you can see the, the, the OS feeding back information about what's coming down, installing, still installing, <laughs> okay, so it's there, you can press open, but let's go and see where it is, okay, so this is your, the main viewing panels and there are other ones eventually that you can uh, skip to when this one's full. Back here, top right of the screen, four little squares together in a larger square, will give you your applications where all of them end up, whether you decide to have them on your front screen or not, and iPlayer's landed there. Press and hold. There we go, press and hold, just goes to show I'm supposed to know what I'm doing with these devices and you can still press them funny sometimes. There you go, I play it now through onto the front of your uh, system. So let's just do that again so you can see what we're talking about. Let's do the same with another app we just brought out that's, that, that was already on there but you could have just brought down from the store 
Angry Birds press. You're still holding the remote, so just to see, still holding that central button on the remote. Oh, let me do it again because showing you that made it go off. And there we go. There's your front screen. Press and hold, and you can start moving it around to a different spot. Okay.